just uh, heading to pick up the old lady. I had a conversation earlier with a buddy of mine, and uh, he's the only guy I know that thinks he's lucky. Like, he actually thinks, he's like, holy shit, the shit that's happened to me in the past fuck, 10 years is pretty insane. And we're going over a couple other things. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm like, he's the only guy that thinks he's lucky. He genuinely thinks he's lucky, which is wicked. And he, not fortunate, not like blessed, but like luck. Probably blessed, unfortunately, a bit, but he, it's a, he thinks he's lucky. Shit, he just thinks shit's gonna work out and, and pretty much do whatever and, and he works hard, all this stuff, but it's gonna work out in his favor. So, like, the, the things that have happened to him that we deem lucky and his mindset, those two things can't be separated. And so I got to thinking, good old me, started thinking, well, what the, I started looking at the things that have happened in my life. It's like, holy shit, I'm lucky as fuck. Um, how I started this business was a run-in. Um, with a good family friend who invited me to one thing, to, to this thing that set off the course of events that uh, helped me meet a lot of people and have has helped me form long, lifelong friendships uh, that I would deem lucky. Um, the truck I'm driving, it, it, it's it's a model that it's priced for the model so it's an slt and it's priced like an slt except it's got every option that a lariat has except for leather seats this has cloth seats it's the only thing leather seats you can add for 1400 bucks but it's priced it's low it was low priced for an slt and it has all the options of a lariat which is 10 grand more it's pretty lucky to find that. And you just go through the different things in your life. It doesn't matter where you start. My buddy didn't start, he's, he wasn't born into a wealthy family by any stretch of imagination, nor was that. But we're lucky enough to be born into good families. Uh, lucky enough to have an idea pop into your head and then uh, have the courage, the guts, or the even the wherewithal to follow the, the idea. Um, it's a matter of perspective, being lucky versus being unlucky. And I can take a lesson from this pal of mine um, about luck. Not like, granted if you're a Christian, I'm a Christian, so you think of a lot of things as being blessings and so forth, but um, it's, a, it's a great way to look at things. But when you start thinking you're lucky, um, the bad things that happen to you in life, the uh, like you you kind of see things. Almost everything is an opportunity, which is an insanely productive and great way to live. It's a great perspective to have, and it's just a flip flip of a switch. You just just start thinking you're lucky, and the stuff that like luck and, and so forth starts happening in your life. Trust me, when you start seeing that that, that seeing life as such your life is as such, if that makes sense. It's like uh, that Viktor Frankl quote I had on the last video. Put a link up here when you post this video um, to that last video about the Viktor Frankl quote about being successful. Success isn't something you chase or aspire to have, it's something you are. So you just, you are successful, you are lucky, you are fortunate, you are the man, you are whatever. Uh, it's like happiness. You are happy. You, you don't chase happiness. That doesn't work. It, it, it's not something you can chase. It's something you, you have to be. Lucky is something you have to be. Uh, successful is something you have to be. So, just a quick thought. Going to pick up the old lady right now. Going to take her out for a little beer. It's 27 degrees today. A nice day. It's, it's been a long ass winter. Let's have some beer while it's sunny out. Um, takeaway. Get back to that takeaway. You're lucky. List five things uh, that you were fortunate to, to have happen in your life. What's another one? 
truck. Yeah, this truck, the last truck I got a great deal on, uh, I just drove the hell out of it and had to sell it before uh, problems started happening. Teddy, like holy shit, that's just about the best dog I could possibly have. And that little bastard is wicked. And I could have had a shitty dog with a shitty temperament, but I was lucky enough to, to get that dog. Um, man, I could just go down the list. It just flips, flips your world upside down, or in a good way. It puts it right side up when you start thinking you're lucky. And then you start looking at the, the things in your life that you had no real hand in creating. Sure, you become the guy that, that, that gets these things uh, thrown into your life, but fuck, look, I had to look for this truck. I, did, I spent three weeks trying to find it. I was driving a rental while I was looking for this. Uh, but still, someone else could have got it. Someone else could have taken action on it. I, I found it and right away went and got it. Um, yeah, I don't know. Take that tidbit. Do, do what you will with it. Um, if you start thinking you're lucky, trust me, some, some good things are going to happen. And if you can keep that mindset up, you're going to live a pretty wicked life. Uh, all right, that's it. I'll put a little gift there for you down below. And I hope you have a very lucky day, as it were. Talk soon.